Sam's on the case here with AZ Billiards, brought to you by PoolDog.com. Joining me today is Gail Glazebrook, the 2010 BCAPL Women's Open Champion. We've asked her to empty out her case and show us her gear. Let's start with your playing cue, Gail. Thank you for joining us. Hi, everybody. How are you? Um, I, of course, play with a Predator P2. I actually started playing with Tony's cue whenever I didn't have my cue around. Fell in love with the cue. It's got a little bit of a skinnier butt than a lot of other cues. So Tony bought that for my birthday this year. So I'm completely and totally in love with it. And um, it's the all maple one with the stack leather. Okay, stack leather wrap. What's the weight on your cue? 19, 19 ounces. Tony's is an 18, so I always complained. So he knew to get one ounce more. <laughs> All right, and what, how about what kind of tips, playing tips, do you like to use? Um, that's the standard one that came on the Predator, and then the actual break cue, we had to actually switch uh, to a leather tip because of the rules for this year. So, sure. um, and that break cue is the poison break cue, break jump, the X. That's pretty new on the market, right? Yeah, actually, it, it was part of our sponsorship deal with the web series that they've been doing for my girls' team, Kiss of Death. So. We're very lucky. <laughs> very nice. Um, you have pretty simple stuff here. Nothing too personal or flashy. Let's. Um, I like these shot pads that you have here. <laughs> Can yeah. we look at the first play page? Is that I, okay? You snuck a peek earlier. I saw. I did. Let's um, see if we can get that first page. That's open. a. That's Tony. Uh, actually, that's me. <laughs> via Tony drawing, um, just giving me words of encouragement. Courtesy of Mr. Robles. Yeah, that's, that's Tony Robles drawing, artistry right there. And um, I just like to, you know, leave little notes for myself. You know, Tony, I'll go home sometimes and I'll show Tony a shot that I struggled with. And, you know, he'll just kind of give me insider tips. So Nice. Well, these are pretty handy to have. Definitely. Uh, this Kamui um, little... Yeah, that's a little tip shaper. Um, you know, they, they wanted to talk to Kiss of Death this year, and so they were interested in us trying some of their, their equipment. So, yeah. Excellent, excellent. Some business cards, yours and Tony's, I see. Um, do you use this tool very often? Yes, I actually love that. It gets so dirty, uh, the, the shaft, so that just gives it a nice little clean, fresh feel whenever it gets too dirty. Um, the business cards are something that are pretty interesting for me and Tony it actually highlights our Predator Nine Ball Tour in the Northeast as well as the National Amateur Pool League that we started last fall. So Nice, of yeah. course too we have our poison patch, a uh, handy pen, um, some Advil. Yes there's actually this is not just Advil I keep B12 in there whenever you're feeling tired in a tournament and you need kind of some some juice to remind you stay focused a so left. <laughs> yeah sure. so anyways um we use master shock kamui soft mm -hmm. tips um oh that's nothing yes <laughs> that's just in case i need uh, something to hold something else in so all right and moving on to your case this is a two by two um i yeah i just got this from pool dog we actually won tony and i won your photo contest with frank so we had a, a credit for pool dog so pool dog was nice enough to send me a brand new case with the credit that we won and um, i want to just carry something a little bit lighter for the tournament since i have the poison break jump i didn't need to have three different cues very so. nice very yeah. nice well best of luck to you in your next term tournament thank you so much sam bye everybody all right gail glaze book with me sam Diep. make sure you tune into azbilliards.com for your a to z and pool and billiards take care